What is up, everyone? It is Carlisle Simmons, also known as Agato, and today we're back with some more Spy Family. You know who we're here to see. We're here to see the best girl, Anya, and to see whatever she gets into, because I'm really looking forward to this. This is probably one of my favorite shows um, this season. Uh, also, the reason why I like it is because they keep the pacing uh, pretty good, but I got a question for y'all. Is it just me, or does Spy Family not really have too much rewatchability? I feel like after I watch one episode of it, I'm like, all right, cool, I'm done, and I don't need to watch more. And, and there's nothing wrong with that. I just feel like it doesn't really have too much rewatch value, you know? Um, but uh, as always, follow me on my all my socials. Uh, they will all be in the description. I really do appreciate it. Um, I'll be very honest. I am probably not going to be putting out too much content. I am going through a lot right now, and I am focusing on my mental health over everything else. So, if anything, I'll probably put out some gaming content. I uh, hope you guys don't mind. It just, it's just a little easier right now. But with all that being said, I think we can just get into the reaction. Oh, I feel so bad for Anya. She is not good with answers. Did she get it right? <laughs> oh, my God. This, this is Anya. Like, she got the answer wrong and everything. <laughs> but... But, but I mean, this is the problem with Anya. She's just not the smartest at all. And you think that she would be, considering that she could read people's minds, but she doesn't even do that. <laughs> yeah, Lloyd is losing it. Who are they after? I'm wondering. Wait, are they going for Yord? Oh, damn. So we finally get to meet the brother, huh? They look like twins. Damn, this guy's intense. Oh, they beat the shit up out of him. So I wonder who they're actually going to get. Like, if they're going to get any information and if they're going to soon realize that they're probably going to have to go after Yor. Well, Yor isn't a spy. She's just an assassin. So I wonder if they would go after her. <gasps> Wait, that's Yor's brother, isn't it? Holy shit. Holy shit on a stick. Holy fuck. Yor's brother is... Is... Working for the... For the for the for the police the the, the counterintelligence. So I wonder if he's gonna pick up on any signs of uh of Lloyd of Twilight when they finally meet. I like how he's more excited about you than anything. Man got caught red-handed now. He is screwed. Yori uh, Yori is just. He's gonna I feel like he's gonna be a good match for uh for Twilight for Lloyd. Oh shit. He knows about Twilight. This is bad. This is not good. Out of all the people that Lloyd could have ended up with, he ended up with one of the greatest assassins whose brother is part of the secret police and knows about him and wants to bring him down. And you get a lot of your uh a lot of your actions from your sis. Holy shit. Yo, this man is a demon. Look at them eyes, bro. Fucking strike fear into anyone's heart. So Lloyd is going to figure out that it's going to be a lot easier to teach Anya stuff if he uses guns and things of that nature. God damn. Oh, God. He's already imagining the worst. And unfortunately, the worst in this situation is true. It, it, your sister is fake married to Twilight, who you hate. Oh, gosh, this is just awkward on so many levels. So I wonder what's going to happen now because they're all trying to protect their own identities. And because they're so enwrapped in trying to protect their own identities, I think like they're not figuring out what each what, what each person actually does. So I'm wondering if it's going to play out like that now. Let's see how this goes. It, it, these two are lying to each other. On, on such a deep, deep level that it's just kind of crazy to me. That That is your perfect lies that you, you forgot. It is Yor that just much of a ditz that Yori is believing this, just, just straight up. If so, holy shit. Yo, he is straight up freaking out over this. The brother is most likely in love with Yor. And that's why he might be this overprotective. I, I don't know. Something's definitely wrong with the brother. Oh, he can't really talk about his work. Lloyd is playing this perfectly. He knows something's up. He figured it out. He already figured it out. 
And because Yori is drunk, he hasn't figured out that Lloyd has been playing him all along. Yo, in seconds, in in a mere few seconds, Twilight has put all of this together. He has not lost his age at all. Man, I feel bad for them. Holy shit! Is that how you're gonna come in? And your brother's really getting to think that you had a side job? No, you're a killer. Why did he call him Lloydy? Lloyd's about to fucking spit some real fucking game and gain Yori as an ally right now, I think. Let's see what he says. That's right. Talk your shit, Lloyd. Talk your shit. Uh-oh. That, that was bad. He is questioning things. He figured something out. He was... Lloyd was so close. Lloyd was so damn close. They almost got away with it, too. If it wasn't for her meddling brother. Oh, they're finally gonna kiss. Damn. Yori's crazy. He is... Just just kiss her. Just Twilight, just kiss her. Just Lloyd, just, just kiss her. It's gonna, it's gonna be alright. It's gonna be alright. Yori is just about to explode. Yo, Yori is about to become a fucking fire hydrant right now. She does not know what to do with Twilight. Really about to kiss her. It's going to end right here, I bet. That was a good episode. That was definitely a fun episode. I enjoyed that. Oh, God, man. I can't, I can't wait to see what happens next week. Uh, on that note, though, I'm out. I hope you guys have a beautiful day.